Logan Rand here playing Farming Simulator 22, and welcome back to the Upper Mississippi River Valley, where we are, well, looks like, um, yeah, looks like more shenanigans. Uh, anyway, we're supposed to be working on harvesting uh, corn here on uh, this episode. I'm actually just riding back here with the uh, truck. I literally just turned auto drive on here. I finished uh, helping auto drive unload here, because... Yep, I've said it before, when all these field entrances, the uh, the farm entrance, actually the field entrance here might be, is he going to make that? Uh, seems like he should have made that if he would have gone over a little bit more, but anyway. Uh, yeah, auto drive is not particularly a fan of most of these, and looks like auto drive is also being a little bit derpy here at times too. I'm not entirely sure what he's trying to do over here, like we were having last episode as well, just like trying to go the wrong way, you know, unload on the wrong side of the combine. Hmm. I wonder what other... Wow, how many moves? What the heck? I'm um, oh. Why can I not pick this up? Fine, pick the truck up. There we go. I don't know why I can't pick the trailer up. That's kind of weird. So I'll do that. And you need to go, like, the other way there, bud. Oh, there you go. Or you could just uh, quit, too, I suppose. That, uh, that'll probably also work. Uh, what's, what's your problem? Uh, let's see. Oh, did the other, uh, the other truck, I wonder if went and unloaded the combine instead. That's probably what is going on. Uh, anyway, since the last episode, finished up the other field oven. So we're done with field 44. That field is finished. Uh, we've moved on to field 43 here. This field probably won't take long. We might even finish it here this episode. We'll see you once. We're working on the second headland here. Almost done with that. Yeah, as you can see, I'm like, we finished the headland here and like, uh, probably 75% of the field will be done. So... Okay, anyway, we have uh, soybean straw on field 45. We have corn fodder on field 44. I wanted to get uh, some of our baling equipment out and working on that here uh, this episode. And then we'll see what we have time for. Might come back and uh, do a little corn harvesting ourselves here. Like, come on, really? This was all done by course, Pevin, so you, you folks can't blame me for any of the missing spots here. This is not my fault this time around. That's going to be all course play. Ooh, and that reminds me too, before I forget, before we get to field 42 of an I want to see once here if we need lime on this field. Let's actually just run over here real quick. Uh, I just realized I forgot about that. We were kind of briefly talking about that there last episode. I mean, we need like, what, 125,000 liters of lime? Yes, you folks heard that correctly. 125, oh, actually, you know what? We might not need any. It says we're good. Whew. Oh, uh, maybe not, maybe not. I thought that was too good to be true, Evan. Typically, whenever you buy a field, everyone, it always needs lime. Like, you, yeah, it needs lime. So, yeah, there, it's, it's like bad. Yeah, there's an okay one. That's okay. Let's see, once if we uh, look at the precision farming screen, which for some reason has moved further up the list. I'm still not sure what's up with that. Huh. Back there was not, and this must be a different. Uh, Soil type. Oh, did uh, I thought, didn't I purchase the, uh, oh, seed rate. Oh, one more. There we go. Soil type. That's the one I was looking for. Oh, yeah. Sandy loam right there. Okay. Well, I suppose we should probably put some lime on this field. I don't know if we want the best uh, yield. And I don't know you folks. I kind of like to have good yields. So lime it is. I think the lime box is on here. Yes, it is. Perfect. And speaking of lime, by the way, again, we are going to need... A metric crap ton of lime. I am still debating whether I want to, like, uh, just turn on the buy options so we don't have to worry about it because we're going to be, like, constantly filling up lime otherwise. Now, mind you, I do have the uh, convey all, which will hold lime. And I don't remember how much that convey all holds yet. We probably have to fill that thing up, like, twice just to have enough lime over there, I'm guessing. We'll see once I might start out with it turned off, everyone. We'll see once how quickly it goes here. Uh, maybe it'll last longer than what I think it will. But if not, we might just end up turning that on. It, supposedly, it's probably going to cost us more money, but... Yeah. I don't want to have to be uh, refilling lime every five seconds either. Probably should check and see how much lime do we have in here. Oh, let's see. How much lime do we have? We have, oh, wow. We actually have a fair amount of lime. 154,000 liters of lime at the moment. Well, might not have enough lime in there at the moment. That is rather impressive, if you ask me. I would not have thought we had that much lime on hand.
Okay, to the field we go. Actually, you know what? I could probably just have auto drive drive out there. Why, why drive out there myself, right, everyone? Just uh, go to field 42. I'm a little disappointed, everyone, that the uh, field 42 is under this one. Because that's the only field that I have, everyone, that is under the next group. Otherwise, uh, 43 through the rest, I'm all on, you know, 43. What's, uh, what's the next field number? 43. So, oh, through 63. That's what it is. 43 through 63. Oh, that's a, that's a turn there, uh, auto drive. Anyway. Okay, next tractor I'm going to need while the self-propelled sprayer is getting over there. Oh, wrong. No, I'm on the right screen, aren't I? Why can't, there we go. Why is it not letting me click on the tractor here? Oh, the tractor and the bale are out here. Well, perfect. And let's see, I don't think I had course play run on really any of these operations, did I? I don't think so, Evan. I did a lot of the soybeans and the corn myself here so far. Uh, now, once we get to field 43, that story does change slightly. I could put course play on that one, everyone. Or I'm, I'll put the baler right on the combines course play course, because I did have course play do that one. But we are going to need to rake the other uh, two fields here, because again, like I said, I did those myself for the most part. Okay, we'll get rid of this course. I don't remember if we have one for this field here or not. Uh, speaking of what, we are going to have to move this uh, truck and header, aren't we? Otherwise, I can uh, get in the field. Moving out. Oh, well, let's put that away here in a few minutes. Get the uh, course play started first, then we'll come back to it. Okay, and this is a uh, field 45, right? 45. Do we have a course play course for field 45? It looks like we do. That is a 50 foot harvest, though. I don't know. That's probably not the course I want. So we're actually going to have to make one, I guess. Probably, yeah, that's probably what happened last time I ran this uh, course. And then ran the baler on this course, so I didn't have to run the rake. But uh, we didn't do that here this time around, so. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and generate that course here a minute. And then we'll also uh, save that course here as well. Save course. Activate that. Uh, field 45, 15-meter rake bale. And then first waypoint, drive the course. Oh, it's going to fold it back out, isn't it, right? Because the start point is... I don't know why, but... Yeah, like, if you tell to start on the up and down rows first, it seems like it always goes to the opposite end of the field when it does that. It doesn't start, like, close. I don't know why that is, but... Eh, whatever. Now, if you tell it to start at the headland, everyone, then that headland waypoint, wherever you're sitting, will typically be the uh, closest. Okay, let's put the truck away a minute. We'll hop over to the uh, spreader then. We'll get the spreader started. And like I said, I'll be very curious. I'm going to see once uh, how far that line goes. I'm suspecting not very far. You know, given the fact we had to fill the sprayer up, what was it four times, I think? I kind of lost count of them, but I think it was four times. And that's for liquid fertilizer, which... Um, you can a lot of times do an entire field on liquid fertilizer, right? How many times are we going to have to fill that lime uh, spreader up? I probably don't want to know, do I? Be a good time to get the Pro Force back out. I'm not sure how much the uh, Pro Force holds versus the current spreader, but it seems like it should hold uh, considerably more. Okay, let's get rid of that. Load up a course here. Probably should drive on the field just a little bit further. There we go. And number of headlands. Yeah, to be honest, one should probably be pretty good. Generate course. Like I was saying just a moment ago, typically wherever you start on the headland when it comes to generate course by course, that's where the start point is.
Okay, like I said, we'll see once how far that goes, Evan. Uh, in the meantime, though, um, actually, how are we looking over here? We're doing okay over here? Make sure everything's going okay over here a minute. And if it is, let's maybe go round up our convey all here a minute. Yeah, looks like we're doing pretty good. Let's see if we can go find the uh, convey all a minute and put some lime in that, maybe. At least have some uh, lime ready to go. Again, not saying we're necessarily going to use this per se, but if we need to, we'll have it. So we have just uh, seeds in here at the moment. Uh, can we open the cover? Yes, we can. Excellent. So just, uh, I think just the one bin of seeds. Okay. Let's see, maybe we put like lime in the last uh, two or three here then or something. That's a tight turn. We made it, though. Oh, okay, let's park in here somewhere. Hopefully that'll fill up the uh, correct one. And we want lime. 18... 18,000 liters? Is that just showing me how much it goes in it, maybe? Maybe that's what it is. I was going to say, where's the 18,000? I thought there was 150,000 liters in here or something like that. Uh, oh, okay, it's going to the back one. Like I said, I'm going to see once if we get the last uh, three here filled up with lime or something like that. We have lime in storage, Evan, so technically uh, we can do this without any immediate cost for us. And fill. No? We, we're not going to fill? Okay. And fill. No. Oh, there, there we go. Lime. No, it's filling up that one. Of course that one, because it filled up that one last time. It wouldn't let me fill up any others, so then we go... Uh, yeah. Okay. Please wait while Randy has mental breakdown. The lime amount seems to be going down. Did I, I must have... Did I look at this wrong, everyone? I must have. Oh, yeah, I did. Uh, I looked at how much we can put in it. That's what happened. Okay, so we need to buy some lime if we're going to do this more. Like 100,000 liters of it, probably. See, so, yeah, okay, it's not filling. Okay, we're probably going to have to buy lime then. Might as well, uh, might as well, I suppose. Lime, and we'll do the 100,000 liters. That should last a little while. And then we'll go check and see what's what the price is in the shop here, because the game probably just cheated us out of $50,000 here, if I had to guess. So in here... Oh, wrong one. Big bags. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Lime. And we want... So five. It'll cost us $1,750. So one, uh, 17000 So 17000 minus 74000 That is, what, fifty. 7,000? Do the math right on that one. Maybe 58,000. Boom. There we go. Game cheated us out of $57,000. Which I don't know about you folks. I don't like getting cheated out of $57,000. Okay, you're not going to fill anymore. Really? Why you no fill? It's probably going to fill up another one, I bet. Yep, that's going to fill up that one rather than topping that one off. Ah, <sighs> really, Giants? Really? Like, this is a piece of equipment made by Giants. I mean, you, you would think Giants would be able to get this correct. Again, I, I don't get what is so hard about Giants not comprehending the multiple fill types, 
going into something that can hold multiple fill types like giants why can you not get this this seems like it should be uh you know third grade level here there we go now it's topping off like at this point i'm almost gonna have to use this slime because i don't know that i want this much lime here in this uh, trailer uh, maybe uh, two uh, bins of it, because I would like to have some uh, you know, space for fertilizer and seed as well. well. I don't know how many uh, liters of lime that is, but... Tank is empty. Wow, that, didn't, uh, that is probably the uh, spreader, I'm sure. We'll check the map and see how far I made it. Uh, what do you folks think? I'm thinking like halfway around the headland. I, mean, I could be wrong, but that, that's my guess. Halfway around the headland. I suppose what we could do, I wonder if we really wanted to get uh, sophisticated about it. Actually, let me think. How would we do this? I'm actually not even sure how you do a refill course with course play in uh, 22 here. Now, if course play could use the auto drive routes, I don't know if that's possible or not, but if course play could, course play could use the uh, road network to just drive down to the silo system and fill itself up. I don't think that's going to work, but that would be a really uh, cool concept there. Uh, that was something you could do in previous versions of course play. And you might still be able to do it in this version, too. You might just have to, like, manually record a route or something. But in previous versions, you would uh, record a route to uh, either your unload spot or your load spot, whatever, wherever you're getting your product from or unloading your product to, you would record a route to that. And then you would load a second course on top of that. So you'd actually have two courses loaded at the same time. One essentially was a road route or a, a route to he almost went all the way around. Okay, that's not too bad. Better than I thought it'd be. I'm gonna try to do here, see if we can back in here a minute. See, I'll drive. Look how hard that was there. Just uh, turned right around in there. I don't think I even he, even dipped any wheels off the edge. However, we are going to get stuck here, aren't we? Okay. Really? Let's just uh, do that then. Okay, here we go. Does this uh, pipe move at all? Oh, yes, it does. Excellent. Okay. Couldn't remember if that would, uh, was movable or not. And indeed, it is. Perfect. At least the nice thing about uh, Course 11, I can just tell Course if I go back to the last waypoint. And wherever it left off at, it should resume at that waypoint. And in theory, shouldn't miss anything. You folks just love the in theory part. Oh, are we not? Ooh. I don't think this accepts seeds, so I shouldn't have to worry if I tab past that one at all. Thing. Uh, let's see. Pipe out lime. Oh. Okay. Never mind. I don't even have to do anything. It just, it just starts piping out. Okay. Okay. More than that would be ideal. Is that one empty already? Wow. Wow. Okay then. Oh, wrong button. No, wait. That. Okay, yeah, what's wrong button? Oh, there we go. I actually never even noticed that before. That's kind of cool. You can actually see... Um, is that lime? Oh, yes, it is. Okay, yep. You can actually see the lime down there. And let me guess. It's still not full. No seeds, no. Next one. Okay, then. So, pretty much uh, two and a... Uh, was it like two and a half? 
and maybe not quite half like two and a half bins just to fill this thing up oh my goodness that one oh back it up back it up I don't know if that's because this uh, thing holds more than it should. Oh, wrong button. We can do that one there. Let's do this one. We need course play, not auto drive. Okay, there we go. On your way there, course play, and I'm on it. And I'm curious here. I want to check the map, see what's how we're looking here on our pH here. Oh, yeah. Almost all the way around. Not uh, not too bad there, everyone. I thought that was going to be a whole lot worse than that. So, we might just keep uh, refilling ourselves here. We'll see once how it goes. Also, speaking of refill... Wow. We're, we are done with the cornfield there, Evan. We are already done. I did not think that was going to happen because yeah, now I need to get the lime going here so I can actually start harvesting that field. Maybe I should have started on that a little sooner. Whoops. Well, I guess we could just leave this equipment here for the moment. One moment, I wouldn't. I see that uh, my driver looks like he has done something incredibly stupid over here. Yeah, that. Not sure what he was doing down here. He's supposed to be in the field. Why, why are you backing up there, bud? That, that's a ditch down there. Okay. Need to start on yet. Horse play is on. Apparently being incredibly uh, stupid here at the moment. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, just had to toss him back up on land there. Now he seems to be good. Hopefully he's heading uh, to where he left off at anyway. Hopefully, all right. Okay, how far along is the baler here? Or sorry, the rake. Wow. Talk about a bit of a mess on this field here. Uh, the rake here is going the exact opposite direction that the field has harvested in. Oh, well, I mean, it, it should work, I guess, right? Grab the baler, we'll get the baler headed over there. We can start up baling that field here then. And again, we're going to load up the same course that's on the rake on the baler. Okay, oh, you know what? And I think we started, no, we did not start right here, did we? That's right, it started somewhere else. Okay, well, let's get the uh, course play course loaded up here. Field 45, 15 meter rake. Let's load that course, activate it. First waypoint, drive the course. We'll have lots of uh, bales that need to be uh, transported here again. Probably try to do most of that between episodes here if I can help it, everyone. Not the most exciting work there. Just uh, driving back and forth from the uh, cell point back to the field here. Just uh, load after load of bales. Speaking of load after load, how are we looking here for what we have so far? We just got oats and soybeans. Uh, again, our corn will not show up because it is in the dryer, everyone, which is kind of disappointing. Kind of disappointing, to be honest. Although what we can maybe do... I'm just going to assume dry corn. Actually, let's go double check this. Dry corn probably is sold at the Minneapolis. That's probably the highest uh, sell price, I bet. 353. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything like close to being that high. You know, 1073. Everything else looks like it's about $200 less. I'm also not sure why these are like so much lower. I don't know what's up with that, but no idea. Century Farm Grain. I don't know why. Why is it saying like there's a sell price there? I don't think we make any money when we bring corn there, do we? If we do, I mean, I haven't paid that close attention to it. I don't think we do. I don't know why you would, but 
Okay, anyway, speaking of the dryer, by the way, this one, nope, that one, no, this one back here, there, that's the one I was looking for. We need some propane, and we can put up to a million liters in there, huh? Okay, where would one get propane from? Actually, maybe a more appropriate question, what do I have that holds propane? Fertilizer, propane, yeah, okay, so there's propane, let's go visit here real quick a minute. Barbecue grill bottles. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's the exchange. I'm gonna say that looks like 1895. Hmm. Biden must not quite be president. Or no, wait, that is too Biden president. Yeah, right. Was it 1495 before? I forget. Anyway, does our current trailer hold propane? And if it does, it only probably holds a little bit. Miscellaneous. I'm going to guess, I'm a, is that propane? I'm thinking that red one is propane, that one. So, yeah, looks like that one does hold propane. Let's see once what's in it here. I think it's almost empty. If not, we can always uh, purchase another one here as well, I suppose. Uh, truck, probably a good choice for that. I have no idea how much uh, propane we're going to need here. I'm like, if I fill this uh, trail up, is that going to be enough to do the corn? Or do we need a whole lot more? No idea how that's going to work with the uh, map here. Yeah, we have just a little bit of liquid fertilizer in it, don't we? The only problem with this... Oh, you know what? I wonder if the sprayer has space. The sprayer might have space. Let's check. Might get lucky here, man. Ah, yes, perfect. It does. Excellent. There we go. That should have emptied out the trailer here then. Okay, you know what? I'll bet there is a waypoint for this here somewhere. I wonder what that would be under. Productions? Gas station? Probably not. That's going to actually be gas. Circle farm? Hmm, maybe not. Is there not a spot for this? I thought there would have been. Ah, yes, there is. Okay, and under the bulk buy store. There we go. Turn that on here. We'll just have auto drive drive down there. Potentially, I bet if you put it in the right mode, you could probably even have auto drive fill it. Everyone probably won't bother with that, at least to the that was this time, but. Okay, are you actually doing what you're supposed to? Now you are stuck on a phone. Okay, you know what? You are trying our patience here today. Yeah, that's right. Just just bugger off, would ya? We are going to have to go to the nearest waypoint, I guess. Uh, what was I saying um, a few moments ago? Open about, you know, nice thing about course play. You just tell it to go to the last waypoint and it starts up where it left off. Yeah, scratch that. Okay, here's my point. No, well, only uh, 50 minutes left to uh, spread lime on this field, huh? That actually is not terrible. The only thing uh, you got to remember with that one is we're going to have to refill this thing, and we're going to have to refill it often. So going to refill it often. I wonder if there's something I can do about this, because this is a modded one. Ah, uh, okay. Actually, you know, okay, I'm actually already running the, the modded one, aren't I? The default is... Okay, default is 7,300. I'm actually running the 8,000, just because it was an even number. Hmm. I don't know, but I might just uh, bump this up here a little bit. Just for the lime. Yeah, let's let's do that. Oh, that's a lot of extra money, too. Ooh. Okay, how about this one? That's uh, still quite a bit. 10,000? Fine, if we're going to do it, 15,000. Going with it. Like, yeah, if we're going to transport our lime, oven, we are going to need some real storage here. Let's face it, that little piddly amount that's in there is not going to cut it. So we don't even have enough to fill it up twice there. Now, mind you, if I empty out the seeds here and fill all these up, then there might be enough to fill it twice, but that's still, wow. I'd rather not have to make that many trips here if I can help it. 
Oh, I kind of want to get the combine going, but I don't think I dare get the combine going until we have this field mostly limed. Maybe we don't have to have all of it limed, but at least a good portion of it would be good. Ooh, look at that. We're cranking out bales. Round bales from this map, too. That is not correct. We are doing square bales. I don't know why it shows round. Also, you are missing, uh... You are missing a fair amount there. Oh, because the piles... Because it created them at an angle. The piles are so wide it can't pick it all up, maybe? I don't know. Oh, well. Anyway, with that, I'm going to look at the time here. It looks like it is time to wrap it up here for this episode, unfortunately. So, you folks have any comments or questions, be sure to leave them down below. And until next time.